Energy vibration um, reading for the Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Happy New Year, you Gemini's. I love you guys. How was your holidays? Please like, share these videos. Please subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I want to say to each and every person, um, be alive in this year. You know, it's going to be a year of ups and downs, but go pick up your year reading, your quarter reading, so you can know what is happening. Your readings are about to um, come out. So please cross watch. Cross watch is very important. Cross watch and see what's happening. So this is the first week. First week is an Earth week, and the zodiac energy is also from the heart. So it's going to be very balancing for you, Gemini. So you're an air sign. So let's see what's coming out for the Gemini in this week. We start the week with a four of pentacles. This is good because some of you could be um, checking out what you have given out. Um, and the year you're trying to balance out your financial stability the three of uh, um some sorrows the heartbreaks come in we the fortune is coming up so um you're going to be lucky um there's a situation that is happening uh, at work or with your projects some of you have some regrets but luck is coming in some of you had some regrets but luck is coming in some of you are going to be receiving a new start so this is going to be also good okay and what else is happening is you're going to be um, finishing the week celebrating so in the weekend what we're seeing here basically in the weekend and I'm seeing the three of um, um, in the weekend so the energy of the three of um, ones is here the energy of the three of ones is here and what this is saying is that some of you could be deciding to turn your back on a project or leave something behind okay some of you could be deciding to leave your back on a project or a situation um, with people and situation and you're going to decide to turn your back and leave a and leave the situation behind you for whatever reasons it is okay the central of your week and the effect that you're having is um, it could be something at work or it could be something that you're working on with a group but you're deciding um, to turn your back on this thing now some the wheel of fortune is bringing luck but some of you it's like yeah but I wanted something else okay yeah but I wanted something else now the three of swords is here some art breaks and you're going to be deciding to move away okay some art breaks and you're going to be deciding to move away now the number three has a focus and the number four um, three four and seven is your number in this week there is three times three call upon the ascendance masters you have the three of swords the three of ones and the three of cups it's the first week first week of the year let's see what is in the balance because I've changed up the reading you people need to protect yourself these things are in reverse what is happening here okay so some of you are not protecting yourself properly um, from someone you're having a relationship with so you decide um, whoa wake up honey um, and the page of cups okay so what is happening is um, you're having um, really um, a bad situation in your relationship your relationship is not good for the people who are in relationships and this is why um, the seven of Pentacles comes up which is like a project it's, uh, all relationships has to do with you working on something now why is transpiring if you notice all of these cards are in the reverse so you um, that you know it's a situation that you need to protect you really need to protect your relationship okay you're deciding that you're you want to move away from your relationship and um, there is something that is uh, affecting your relationship and it's this negative forces coming in that is affecting your relationship there are some negative forces that is coming in that is affecting your relationship okay so it's all about relationships that is happening a lot of three four and seven three is working in connection with others okay and I'm seeing that um, some celebration is here but some people are about to walk away so here it is 
some of you um, your relationship could be ending or you could be walking away from something in your life okay because it's as if you've realized you have a, you know the energy of heartbreak and it's right over the energy of heartbreak um, some of you um, it could be in the holidays um, you you're very heartbroken over a relationship and you're going to decide to turn your back on this relationship and to move forward very heartbroken over a relationship and you're deciding it's, it's it's the central um it, it does have to be it could be different relationship different situation it could be you and your friends were in business or you and your friends were connecting together and because of money um you know you're going to be ending this relationship or this situation whatever it is it has to do with some of you your relationship is affected because the love um, what you were looking forward in your relationship is not coming up for you because of the love that is happening okay so the four of Pentacles is coming up very very and the four of Pentacles is as if you guys want to just hold on to what you have and some of you are heartbroken door um, the energy of the four of Pentacles so let's see what is coming up with the energy of the four of Pentacles you're holding on to your money um you receive some news about heartbreak but new love the wheel of fortune is bringing you in a new love um you are going to be victoriously coming out of a situation that you were dealing with you had some regrets and you're going to decide you're going to be moving forward the energy of the five of pentacles you're moving on a new journey some of you are going to be celebrating because you're going to be finding someone else who is really going to be connecting with you so this is good I'm loving this for you guys so here we are some of you are holding on, on very tight on your financial stability and this is good whatever you're receiving a hold on tight to it because you're not sure what is going to be happening um, you know protect you're, you're thinking about your financial security this is what some of you are coming in this week uh, thinking about now some of you had some heartbreaks in the past and some news could be coming in um some news could be coming in which is um going to be heartbroken or um what is transpiring is that you're going to be realizing um that it's time to let go of something that no longer serve you okay so you could be receiving news of a heartbreak but a heartbreak was there and then the ace of rods so some news is going to be coming in and whatever news your partner could be saying you know I'm ending this relationship and I'm moving forward okay bye let it go okay because you have endings moving away from a situation wheel of fortune is coming in some of you are going to be meeting someone of a past life and some new love is coming in the universe is going to bless you the universe is going to be sending someone very beautiful in your life for some of you you're going to be reconnecting with a past life someone from a past life who is going to be bringing you love the universe is going to be bringing you love back in your life and this is positive now some of you could be overcoming a situation that has transpired this is the energy of the seven of Pentacles it could be a business a project that you're working on it's going to be very successful so open up watch the energies because some good news could be coming in for the people who have business or the people who have applied for a job that sort of a thing good news is going to be coming in now there was some regret some of you have some regret in the past about love but now someone new has come in and you are taking a new journey and you're going to take a new start in your life so what has transpired is that there was a situation in the past a, a love relationship or that sort of a thing the universe has bring someone new so you're letting go of the regrets and you're um, moving forward in your life and this is good now what we're seeing is that um, there was some heartbreaks there was some heartbreaks that has transpired and you decide to let go because news come in and there was some heartbreaks that then that has transpired you decided to let go some news come in and this news is helping you to move forward as you do that close your eyes um, go with this your intuition feeling turn your back on something that no longer serve you because obviously the three of swords came in in the 
um, in this week and some news some heartbreaking news came in and you're going to decide hey bye and take the energy and you're going to start out feeling in hardship because you have lost something that was very important to you but you're going to be letting it go because as you let go of that thing something much beautiful is going to be coming in now wonderful energies that is here for some of you some of you are going to be reconnecting and some of you are going to be really celebrating together um, especially the people who has had some heartbreaking relationships someone new is going to be coming in you're going to be connecting with someone who's very positive and this person is going to be helping you to align you in very wonderful positive way this person is going to bring a, a build a new strong foundation with you some of you could be getting married some of you could be getting engaged some of you are going to be moving in together but this is a really really positive the three of cups meaning celebration with someone else connecting on a very positive note a lot of celebrations is going to be happening in this week it is the changing of the year so a lot of you are going to be connecting with the right partner it's as if your spirit guides are going to be bringing them in and you're going to be connecting on a powerful way so guys this is good so love you guys um this is really the starting out of a, a new year and a new week and whatever it is with the seven of wands and the lovers because a lot of relationship is being affected in this week um a lot of people are going to be just turning away and walking away from their relationship situations but they're going to be connecting with new people as you decide for your sent to end the relationship like new people are going to be coming in for you so you Gemini's what's happening for the Gemini's please cross watch to see who these people are because um, it's not all I, it, what is showing up is the lovers so obviously there is a lot of you your relationship but I'm seeing celebration you're ending with you know you connecting with people it could be New Year's um, you could have met someone um, at the changing of the year but you're connected with someone so for the people who have been very hurt very lost some of you have been listening and worrying for the whole holidays that your relationship hasn't been good and some of you decide to, to leave you know that sort of a thing okay this is card one so if you choose this card or you choose card two so remember the, the end with a ring on is card one and this is card two okay so choose one of these cards to see the effect and what it is you should focus on in this week because we're changing up the readings it's the new year guys okay so if you choose card one it is restriction restriction okay so some of you are going to be restricted but you're going to be moving um, this restriction okay so some of you could be restricted but you're going to be rebelliously removing this restriction okay and whatever and I'm gonna ask a question about this restriction who and what okay so hold on um, hold on number two so restriction oh they're saying that restriction has to do with the relationship people who are married and uh, you know um, there's things that is affecting you but I'm going to look at restriction with these cards to see uh, oh alrighty okay let's see what's happening for the restriction why are the Gemini's being restricted okay uh, five of swords okay so what they're saying is that the, the um see it comes out in um, the five of swords in reverse um, you yourself could be restricting you in this week through your thought pattern and you're going to change this around okay so do not let your thought restrict you or do not let people restrict you okay that is what it's, um, they're saying okay now let's look at the hark the second card is the omen and the message so some of you could be receiving some intuition message right in the dream time um, the energy of the hawk is the hawk, the bird, and what this could be doing is bringing you some messages, okay? And this messages could be coming in um, the dream time. I want to see what else the hawk has to say because 
they're saying that via the dream time you're going to be receiving information about your partner okay so the energy of the whoo i you know i'm i'm this year is a change of guard for everyone but also for myself eight of swords um the eight of swords um it's like seeing the arcs okay all right the eight of swords it's like you seeing and the nine of pentacles okay so this is how it came out because it was like this way okay so damn okay so the energy of the heart but is this the same with the energy of the heart the energy of the heart which is the omen and the messages that is coming in is that there you are you weren't seeing a situation about your financial stability and now you're understanding um, some of you are going to be receiving message in your dream time about money how to make money and that sort of a thing some of you are going to be receiving messages about your partner so be open about that I love this new um, way of reading I want to say namaste until next time